Hi there, it's Ali here, good afternoon. Um, I'm just coming to you with a, a very quick um, video. I got my uh, jelly plate out and I thought I would have a play with some stencils um, and the jelly plate and just show you um, how you can create some fantastic backgrounds. I was having a play earlier on and just with the stencils I've created just these for now and then I thought oh, I'll jump on and do a video before I make any more. Um, and then I can show you exactly what I do. Really simple <clears throat> if you've got a jelly plate. Um, I've got one of the big ones. Um, I've had it for a while and I think I've probably used it about five times. So I thought, right, time to get out and play with it now and uh, show you what we can do. Now, all I've done, really, really simple. Um, nothing special. I bought these. I've an absolute ton of stencils. And I got them from the range and they buy craft sensations and I think they were 2 99 for a pack and you get you get five in a pack uh, it might even have been 199 actually so they were cheap as chips and there's some fantastic I mean look at them absolutely fantastic the generic um, and basically kind of almost a stencil for everything you can imagine um, so I've got loads of those to play with um, I've just took these out for now and I'm going to just get on with it so just picked a few colours and I'm just spraying it on a bit of hot pink a um, bit of aged teal because I love pink and blue together and then we'll pop some yellow on there as well okie dokie so for the first sort of print if you like um, I've just created the background which is like a I'll just peel this off now just gives you that which I think is great in itself anyway and then what you can do to add to that I think we'll take this one so because I've got such a big jelly plate I'm going to do I'm just going to pop a couple of stencils on so that I can cut them out and do sort of two A5, A6 cards. Um, just get a bit more bang from your book, so to speak. Right, so <clears throat> I've used the yellow, blue and pink on there. So let's have a look. Pop a bit of Dusky Plum. Um, obviously it needs to be something that's going to show up onto the... Um, print that you've made so a bit of precious purple um let's have a look what else have we got sage green oh, a bit of that on and what else have we got i won't use the old brown because it might just dirty it up a little bit um uh, let's just try that so <clears throat> what you're doing now is you sort of create on top of there you put in um, another layer so and you press press it down just use your hands press it down you're pressing into the spaces in the stencils um, and it will pick up the pattern and then lift it up oops Daisy and get the pattern there again it will dry lighter um pop another one on what i found as well is you can get what was on the stencil outside if you like sort of on here you can get and you pick that up there and you get the inside so that's another background that you can have. So, um, have another. I'm trying to find. So open this packet. So, I like that one, so we'll pop that one down. And. I like this one, so I'll pop that one down. So I've a bit of hot pink and 
some aged teal. So this time I'm going to do it the other way around, if you like, and create the background with just the shape in the background. So I'll put that on the top. Give it a good squidge down. Like so. And lift that up. Oh wow, look at that. It's magic that, isn't it? And like I say, because it's, I've got a big jelly plate, um, I've made it so I can create two cards out of there. And again, find some of my spray off paper. And I'll just pick up the last bits. And then pop it on. And it just picks up that kind of negative side, if you like. And it gives me another two pieces of um, background that I can uh, create another project with. So that is just, just a really quick one, uh, five minutes, just to show you um, how you can make um, jelly plate backgrounds. So I hope you enjoyed that. And I'll get back to you really soon with another video. Ta-ta for now.